guys, my name's Lane. I'm here at uh, Colerain Family RV with Fort Wayne, Indiana. Um, we're going to be talking about the Hitch 17 VHS today. Um, we'll start over here. Let's see here. So first and foremost, uh, you're going to have the electric power tongue jack here, um, which is super convenient. No longer you're going to be sitting here cranking things out. Um, you're going to have two 20 gallon um, LP tanks with a nice covering. Um, you're going to have two of these D rings here. So super, super nice. So if you have a pet or anything like that, you can kind of tie that up either here um, or actually in the back. One good thing about this unit here, um, compared to a lot of these other units, is it's going to have one of the biggest storage compartments I've ever seen on a unit like this. I mean, it's absolutely gigantic. You can put pretty much anything you want in there. Um, back there, you're going to see a 1200 watt inverter um, because you have a 110 watt solar panel that's going to be standard on this unit um, with your control pad here. So next we're going to have this nice 13 foot electric awning here. Um, and as we go along here, you'll see these nice uh, blue lighting along the steps here. So at nighttime, you can kind of see what's going on when you're stepping in and out of your unit. Um, as you'll see here, you're going to have a one year um, limited warranty with the factory as well as a three year structural warranty. Um, you're going to have this climate defense, which basically, um, because you have this 47 gallon freshwater tank, that's actually going to have a heating pad on it, um, which is super, super nice. You're going to have this nice, uh, metal removable table that you can actually put on each side of the unit. Um, super nice for either television or if you have all your chairs set up, maybe some food. Um, but speaking of the television, if you want to set that up, you have a nice electric outlet up here, as well as a cable connection. And then easy access panel to your refrigerator. Um, you pay somebody a lot of money to get in and work on your unit, so the quicker you can get in and do so um, and out, the better and more cost efficient it will be for you. Uh, another thing you're going to see here is you've got 15 inch tires here uh, with aluminum rim and they even go as far as giving you that matching tire um, which is something that a lot of manufacturers actually don't do so that's a really really cool thing really cool feature to have on this unit um, you're going to see here you have a little firewood holder as well as maybe a, a camp camping chair or whatever you might think you can fill that space with but just a nice little bit of a storage for you then you come back here and you're going to see this little easy access door here. So if you lift this up, it kind of attaches right here. And what that's going to do is going to allow all this space for storage. Um, a lot of people use it for bikes or wheelchairs or whatever you might think you can fill this, this area up with. Um, but it's a super, super nice feature to have on a small unit like this. Next, you're going to see you're going to have your... Uh, connection here for your 30 amp service, um, your city water connection, and again where this table will connect right here that you saw on the other side. Um, so with that you'll have a satellite cable uh, connection and then you're also going to have your outdoor sh uh, shower. And as you come through here, you can kind of see this side of the storage and you can see again how that 1200 12, watt inverter as well as a nice little LED strip light here so you can see what at night when you're kind of getting all set up. So the hitch is also going to be constructed out of a aluminum framing, a 16 inch on center. Um, you're going to have Asdale sidewall backing um, as well as the floor being constructed out of 5 inch or 5 eighth inch plywood tongue and groove um, which is something we'll talk about when we go inside so let's go ahead and do so now. So you can see this nice finish we have here on that flooring I was just talking to you about. Um, but first and foremost, we'll go over this. Um, you're going to have a nice control panel, easy to access inside or outside um, because of the height and where that's located, which is super convenient. Um, battery disconnect. And then straight up above that, you're going to have your, your controls here for your outdoor speakers um, and your indoor speakers, easy access, Bluetooth and whatnot. Um, you're going to see here you have a nice TV. It's a little bit smaller TV, but still super convenient to even have one in a unit like this. Um, it can move kind of to any direction you want. So if you're in the box or if you're sitting down in the dinette, it's going to be really easy to see. Um, another thing is you're going to have this nice storage up above here. You're going to have these little holders to keep all of your clothes or whatever you have up there in place. Um, but I really like these because they're easily detachable. Um, and it's something that you can double up and use. So if you have, um, let's say you have firewood in the back or your camping chairs in the back and that little container I was showing you. Um, you can actually use that to kind of help contain everything in there. 
Um, you're gonna have a nice queen size bed here, super comfortable. Um, and then over here along your dinette, um, you're gonna see here, you're gonna have a control panel for your solar, um, which is super nice so that way you don't have to go outside. Uh, if it's cold or hot, you can just easily access and control everything from inside. Um, then you're gonna have your outlet, USB, um, and then obviously your dinette turns into a bed. It's actually super easy to do so. Ooh, a little strength, you know. So first things first, you're gonna pop these out. Sit them right over here. It's just gonna slide right on top of this. Right on top of this. Just like that. And voila, you got a good sized little dinette bed. Um, then you're also gonna have a little easy access fuse box right here. So if you blow a fuse, no need to go outside or anything like that. You can access all that right here. Then if you look over here, one of my favorite things on the unit actually um, is gonna be this sink. So it's a nice deep round sink. So it's something that you can actually put dishes in, actually be able to wash a dish instead of that really small square um, sink, which a lot of your units will have. Then you have the two top burners here. Then as we go over here, you're going to have your microwave, a little bit bigger fridge um, with a nice little size freezer in it, um, gas electric. Then you have a really big bathroom, especially for a unit this size. Something you can actually move around in. Big square shower, medicine cabinet. solid door and then obviously you have your two bunks here um, super nice you actually have USBs on each one of your lights um, with about a 275 pound weight capacity on these um, which is honestly pretty pretty happy um, and then obviously this is where that other bunk is that you can either have down um, or up based upon whatever you're using this if you're using it for storage or to sleep on um, but super super convenient you got storage all around this unit I mean, it's got basically everything you want um, in a small little package. So, uh, yeah, that'd be the hitch.